Hi guys, I'm Shmi, hello, and welcome to an absolutely freezing Chicago. I've just landed at Chicago O'Hare International Airport, where I'm waiting to be picked up by Mike from 312 Supercars with a number of Ferraris, because we're going to be heading straight over to Continental Autosports, the Ferrari dealership here in Chicago, to take delivery of not one, not two, but three new Ferraris at the same time. So we're going to be going in the 812 and the GTC Formula so to the dealership to collect the 488 Pista, the 488 Spider, and a 360 Spider all at the same time. And as well as that, my Ford GT just happens by complete coincidence to be coming here from Detroit to Chicago in the same transporter. So let's do this. Let's wait for the guys any moment now. Hop on board the convoy to the dealership and see the new cars. And here they come, the GTC for Lusso, followed by the 812. We've got Mike's dad up front, we've got Mike in the 812. Let's come straight through, say hello. It is so cold that my hands are actually shaking. Hey on? Mike, how are you doing? Fine. Nice to meet you. You nice too. To meet you. It is so cold outside. Can I, I can Welcome I jump? to Chicago. <laughs> can I jump straight in? Oh, I am absolutely freezing. It I'm is, not going to lie. Oh, yeah, it is kind of, a, uh, kind of a uh, off year with the weather wise right now. It's been. I, that's why I was kind of worried the other day it was snowing already. It was. Just, oh, this wouldn't be great. Yeah, no, it would not all be great. So, of course, in the snow it would not be. <laughs> exactly. <yet. laughs> no, not at all. This is uh, even today a little bit with the cold. It's been kind of hard to get uh, traction and stuff. But uh, yeah, yeah no. especially when you're in an eight to super fast. It's it's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, one hundred percent. It is. We've so got the SVR behind us yep, as well. SVR behind us, um, and then Ooh. yeah, my cousin and uh, one of my friends are in there, and then my dad's in the A12. I mean, in the Luso, sorry. All heading together. This must be a pretty exciting day for you guys. This is really exciting. We've been waiting for a while, and it's it's just it's crazy that it kind of all lined up um, all at the same time. Oh, we got a G63 up on oh, yeah. front as well. So um, I'm just going to point out, guys, that my flight this morning was actually cancelled. So I had to give the guys the bad news yeah. that I was going to be a couple of hours late, and they've very kindly waited until I've made it here. Oh yeah, it's been so we can go over. Yeah, no, it's it's funny because. The, the flights around here are always, for some reason, it's usually, anytime we fly out of Chicago, everything's always delayed or yeah. something like that because of the wind or whatever. So it's it's awesome that you're finally here and that you know we can get everything set up. But I cannot wait. And of all, I just said briefly on video, but by all coincidences, your new Pista happens yep. to be on the same transporter coming from the East Coast, <laughs> having arrived here, it's, as my Ford GT that's coming from Detroit. Yeah, it's it's literally amazing. We've been waiting, so <laughs> the car was originally supposed to come in, uh, in February, or in, uh, in July, excuse me, and then the uh, car got delayed and delayed. I think it was kind of because of the paint. Yeah. So, I, well, we'll keep that secret. For yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. The, the gun, spec of the car is insane. Exactly. Ex exactly. We've been we've been waiting. So when you called me the other day and said that, I was like, this is by fate. And it, <laughs> it all lined up perfectly. Uh, we can go underneath the plane. Lovely. Where's the list I got? Lots yep. of. Yeah, we'll, they'll, they'll they're catch somewhere up. back there. So this is your first time in Chicago, My right? first ever yep. visit to Chicago. Never there been into the city. I've been through the airport, but I've never been into the town. And here we are then. So I've been in Chicago for a grand total of about 15 minutes, literally straight out of the airport, <laughs> straight in the car. And we are now straight at Continental Auto Sports Ferrari dealership. Yup. With <laughs> the Lusso and the 812. This is a pretty cool way to arrive. Oh, and yeah, obviously there are nice cars around. Purple S, Portofino inside, Lizard Green, GT3 RS, Visac, Portofino. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see where this is going. And uh, yeah, not bad, not bad. So, you guys must be excited. Very excited, yeah. This anyway. is going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> Let me go say hello to your folks. We did kind of jump in very quickly. For sure. And, uh, Woo, let's do it. Let's go in. We've just been in to say hellos, but I tell you what, we are very lucky because about two days ago, it was actually snowing out here. So today it is dry. This is ideal for collecting new Ferraris. We have, of course, been in the 812 super fast. This car completely murdered out. The black car, black tinted windows, black wheels, just the red calipers, and of course the yellow Scuderia shields. We all know how much I love that. The Lusso T is actually being traded in. The Lusso T with a 3.9 twin turbo V8. So that car is being traded in against some of the new arrivals. There are some very nice cars. That S65 Cabriolet over there. Really cool. So Continental Autosports is the second oldest Ferrari dealer here in the USA. And they are actually Classic A certified, which means in here we have, and that's actually quite cool, steering wheel, door handles. Some nice cars just to quickly look at before we head through. A 330 and behind it a 250 PF Pininfarina. I've actually been lucky enough to drive one of those before. Then we've got a 308 just here as 
well. But we should head straight through to go and have a look at the new cars. But in fact, before that, we've got some lurking just here to have a look at. Out here, of course, everyone very excited about the six-speed gated manual F430, Portofino 812, 488 Spider, just so at the back. But I'm going to whiz straight through to come and show you some of the cars that are lurking just down here. Well, we have a sea of incredible Ferraris, some very, very nice cars, very nice specifications. In fact, I'm going to pick out that dark red 488 Spider. And also, you can just about see here the cars undercover and something I'm going to show you in the corner. This 812 is really nice, blue Mirabeau with a red interior. Have a look at this. Wow, what a spec on that. Also, a big fan of that kind of spec, cream on the blue, of course, like my old FF. But these are two of the cars that we have come to see, the 360 Spider and the 488 Spider. Two waiting for the third sibling to arrive at the moment. But uh, yeah, this is really cool as well, this color combo blue with the white. So let me just squeeze through very quickly. I've got special permission to come and show you something lurking through here, which I think you're going to like. The silver Ferrari F. 50. Now the workshop has all the cars for storage, it's out of hours at the moment, but look at this. My favourite car with its naturally aspirated V12, the roof panel you can remove, a gated manual gearbox, and this one of the silver ones. And in fact, quite interestingly, you can actually see the weave even through the silver paintwork on this. But what a stunning, stunning car. Absolutely love it. Anyway, let's head back through because we will shortly, I think, either be uncovering these, seeing the spec of the cars, or uh, seeing the pista arrive. I'm just gonna bring attention back quickly to this car, the California T, but one of the 70th anniversary cars, which is in dark green, the stripe of the bonnet, and also with the dark kind of burgundy, almost plum-like roof color, with the tailor-made old-style interior. That is Ferrari, I guess, unique customization as part of the program they did to celebrate their 70th anniversary, where they made 70 different liveries across five different models from the range, and that is one of them on the California T. All right, guys, so we're unveiling the 360 Spider now. Um, you guys will have to see this, obviously. We'll, we'll unveil it. So two additions to the garage. Nice. Right Tour de France blue. Same color as my GTC4 yeah. or so <laughs> on the 360. Oh, tan interior. Blue roof, good spec for a 360. Yeah, so it's TDF blue, and then we have the, uh, the Koyo interior, um, and then it's the gated car, which is pretty cool. Um, really nice inside. It's actually interesting, too, because it has a 2B exhaust, so it's pretty- Oh, okay. Pretty out there. We're not leaving here until we've heard that, then. For sure. <laughs> 2B on the old uh, V8s well, and the 360s. It's got that. Black calipers on silver wheels. I think the big thing the gated is super cool and looks awesome, and then it looks Show nice. The, we'll do the 48 next. And straight back in Formula One style again. <laughs> Cover off. Pulling this one off. That on the 488. The thing about this car is that it was ours before. <laughs> oh. And we actually brought it in. And when we picked up, I believe, the 812, we just switched. And I just brought it back. Oh, so okay. This is actually our, the, the first, well, the second Ferrari, but the first uh, quote unquote special Ferrari that we had, yeah. so we picked it back. Oh, cool. Because we knew it, and we, had, we expected it the way we wanted yeah, it. Yeah, 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 so you know you like the car. Yeah. Exactly. I was thinking as soon as you just pulled the color off, the black with black wheels was very much like the 812 spec. Yes, so it very makes, similar, yeah. It makes we sense. We don't deviate much from our taste. Right? <laughs> <laughs> well, you say that, but everyone needs to wait until the pista arrives. Exactly. exactly. That, that is quite, That's what we're waiting. <laughs> that is quite different to these two. Wow, congrats. Thank two you. lovely cars there. And here comes the truck from Autobox Express, inside which we have the 4GT as well as 312 Supercars Pista. We're going to get these unloaded very, very shortly, and then we will be able to see them outside. But I am not joking, it is freezing here right now. It's very, very cold, but I can't wait, even for me, to get the GT out. This is always very, very exciting, and just a total coincidence that they're on the same truck, completely by chance, with Autobox Express. And here we go! Pistas. We're going to be seeing, wait, where's the GT? GT is right in there, ready to be unloaded in a moment. Exciting, exciting times. Can't wait actually even to get this car out. It's time to open up. You know what, honestly, this is always still so exciting each and every time. Seeing my British plate here now in Illinois, going from state to state. It's been through Indiana and of course 
came from Detroit, Michigan. We will get that out and then we'll be able to see the pista up front. It is the one right up there. There are a whole bunch of Ferraris being delivered. We're waiting for the one at the very front and I can't wait for you to see the spec of it. It's alive, right. Now I need to go and help get this up. Stop, stop, you're good. Of course, you have to make sure that the nose is clear and not going to hit this, and then that can be lowered down to the ground. Magic. It's that easy. Ooh, it's chilly. And out it goes. The beauty of this truck, by the way, completely flat to the ground. Autobox Express helped me a lot during this trip, taking the car all the way across from Miami over towards uh, Monterey Car Week, and then also helped me bring it back over from Las Vegas to Detroit, and now have brought it here to Chicago as well, where uh, yeah, the car is looking absolutely fabulous. Now that is not the car that we have come to see, but I'll tell you what, the spec is cool, obviously with wheel protectors on it. Um, as that gets pulled out, uh, the one we are going to try and see is the one up here somewhere. Oh yeah! Excited? Yeah, I like that color. <laughs> Just, like Just get a quick color. like sneak glimpse up top uh, <laughs> somewhere. Uh, we'll, 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 I almost want to climb up there. <laughs> we'll see it coming out in a second. You'll see it if you stand here. You'll see it like oh. just going past. Yeah, you get that I'll small like teaser mind. look. We can hear it. The car is coming. Here we go. That is Blue Electrico. It is a stunning colour. You're going to see the full spec in just a moment as the car emerges right here. Oh, look at that. Blue Electrico, gloss paint. I'm sure many of you will know TGE's car, which is matte satin Aparco, as Ferrari call it, Blue Electrico. This, this looks super, super nice. Yellow accents might be able to guess what colour the stripe is going to be. We've got the yellow calipers, the yellow centre caps, yellow scooter rear shields. Of course the front lift system is up. But this is the car literally arriving here from the importers. So it needs to go into the shopping room. Oh wow. Look at this. Look at this. Boom. Double yellow stripe, black centre. This is really, really nice. What a car. What a car. And off it comes. I like those wheels. The really thin spokes. Satin black wheels. Ferrari's hardcore 488, of course. 488 Pista, which is going to join the collection alongside the 488 Spider. That's going to be taken to the back. You happy? It's amazing. Yeah? Yeah, thank you. It's just it's amazing. <laughs> It looks really good. And, and you spec'd it, right? Yeah, George and I spec'd it, you know? <laughs> well, you did a good job. <laughs> thank you. Thank wow. You. The charcoal in the black, it's oh, spectacular. Yeah. It's incredible. Thank you so much. Spectacular. Oh. Yellow accent. So yellow stripe on the steering wheel is cool. Brilliant. Oh, yeah, Brilliant. that is. Oh, nice. Brilliant. I see what you've done. Like the two-tone grey wheel, the charcoal grey with the, with the black. Okay, cool. That's come out well. All carbon everywhere. <laughs> carbon door cards. <laughs> ready to go. The yellow seat uh, door pockets. Yellow seat belts. Yellow stripe on the center. Yellow on the paddles. We like. We like. This is top choice of spec. Really good spec. We are. Cold start up, of course. It is bitterly chilly, but we're going to take this car inside to put it with the other two, the trio, all together to wrap up today's collection day. I think they are going to make for a very, very nice looking set when we get them just inside here in a moment. This means it's your first time starting up your pista. Oh yeah, let's, okay, so <laughs> here we go. Nice. We're going to be taking the cars just outside. We took a few quick photos, of course, here inside the showroom. We're going to take all three to the very front door, because of course, when you have this kind of opportunity, how special is it to have them all together? So, nice taking the pista out. Um, We've got the 488 Spider as well, which actually used to be part of the family collection, which is crazy to have now bought the same car back to join the, uh, the garage. You can tell the spec matches nicely with the 812 and then the um, 360 head on out. The trio 
of those cars, which means I am going to run to the other side to line them all up out of the front front. Continental Auto Sports. How cool is this view then? The cars lined up, the 812 over there as well, the four Ferraris, what a quadruple of cars. And well, I guess highlighted now by the pista. Unfortunately, it is not bright sunshine, but I can tell you that Blue Electrico, when the sun is out on the car, is going to look insane. I think the interior works really well as well, obviously bringing the yellow accents to the inside of the car to match with the exterior of the Pista. And I haven't really done too much technical talk about the Pista, but 3.9 litre twin turbo V8, 720 or so horsepower out of the car, rear wheel drive, seven speed dual clutch. This thing is ballistically fast, incredibly, incredibly quick car. And um, I actually quite like how you have the carbon here with the Cavallino, the prancing horse, just sticking slightly up into that uh, opening that you have for the airflow underneath the rear spoiler. But Pista, well, undoubtedly a very special car following from the Challenge Stradale that was based on the 360, the Scuderia that was based on the 430, the Speciale that came before, and then the Pista. Pista literally being the Italian word that means kind of racetrack or circuit. An appropriate name for this car, obviously, that was developed at the Pista di Fiorano Ferrari's test track in Maranello. Anyway, this has been awesome. Big thanks to these guys, Continental Ferrari, here in Chicago for making it possible. They've kind of hovered and bed with us slightly while we've put all of this together um, outside of normal hours. And yeah, really, really special. We had to pull the GT up to put these two cars side by side. And this is when you realize quite how low the Ford GT actually is. But of course, both of these are very track focused in their nature, in their aerodynamics, in what they're built for, in being quite hardcore cars to actually drive as well. And then the 812, the Super Grand Tourer down towards the other end. But this, this is just fantastic. Anyways, you can probably expect, because the car only just arrived, it's going to get its full pre-delivery inspection, uh, being put into full running mode. It's in uh, the delivery mode at the moment, which means it's capped in terms of its speed. It will also get the detailing and preparation that you would expect from the dealership before it's officially actually handed over and available to go out and drive. But nonetheless, very cool to be here today. I say cool, it's absolutely freezing. Honestly, it must be on the verge of negative. I am so cold being outside having taken some photos, but seeing the three Ferraris all together, a huge congratulations goes to 312 Supercars, to Mike and to his dad on these new additions. Fantastic, absolutely fantastic. For there though, I think I'm gonna wrap things up. I need to head into town with the GT to go and check it in and the like. But wow, here we are in Chicago. What a way to arrive. Big thanks to the guys for inviting me along. Amazing, congratulations again. Link down below if you'd like to go and follow them over on Instagram to see more of the antics with the Ferraris. But for now, that is all. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And I'll see you again very soon. Cheers.